My name is Sammy Daps, a white private eye in Mumubuti, Africa. When millionaire Howard H. Fonsworth hired me to find a jungle queen, that's when it all started. Fonsworth seemed a little strange when he stepped into my office, but after he advanced me a good chunk of dough, I took the job. I left Vonsbridge at the railroad station and started into the jungle to find a queen. A couple of days into my search, I came across this pygmy village. The chief dressed up in a six-button Benny looking like a cool fool in the water pool. Must have been no bigger than two foot six. In pygmies, I asked him. The chief said he didn't know. He was lying. As I was about to leave, his bird sound cut through me like a slug of a 45. To find that bird meant to find the queen. I moved into the marshes with a jungle steam. Again that bird sound whistled through. I was closer to the queen now than I knew. The pygmies frozen in terror started to dance with the katanga, cuckoo, cha-cha. All right, everybody, let's dance. Trying not to take a tumble to find where that bird led. Then it happened. I saw this weird looking bird. It flew round and round, very close to the ground, so it finally flew into itself. Too tired out to crawl about, I kept in mind the pygmy rhyme. <laughs> Why you? 